YouTube, what is going on? It's your guy, Kent Poole. We are currently in South Carolina on our way to Joe Fest. Two cons, past two days. In 10 miles, take exit 18 on the right onto Highway 277 South toward I-20 West. There you go, you know exactly where we are now. Uh, thanks a lot, uh, little uh, directional lady. <laughs> but uh, yeah, two cons in two days, uh, big toy hunt day. This is uh, Saturday. Uh, maybe you all will get to see this Sunday. We'll see. Uh, <laughs> it was uh, crazy with uh, Heroes Con and getting that footage up and going. So hopefully <laughs> this will be a little easier to get uh, uploaded and uh, get it going. But if this is your first time finding the channel. I'm your guy. Kent Pool, and we are just uh, right now on the ride. We're gonna go down to Augusta, Georgia. Should be a lot of fun. There was definitely some uh, question marks about uh, how long of a journey this was gonna be. Uh, my phone was acting funny. There was a lot of talk, three hours, but uh, of course this morning, uh, Greg sent me like the parking deck for where we're going to meet up and uh, go to the convention and uh, we're looking at about two and a half hours and we're about uh, almost an hour and 20 minutes in so probably about another hour, hour 15 so we're making a uh, really good time. Uh, definitely have been having so much fun this weekend again there's a hunt video from Thursday there is a con video from Friday and here we are recording again and on to our uh, second con in two days which I guess uh, you know if you think about it people you know do different days of con so I guess it's not a huge deal uh, Friday Saturday in fact we're gonna run into uh, quite a few people today that uh, were at Joe Fest yesterday but uh, the fact that we're traveling to two different cons uh, maybe that's uh, well travel yeah Charlotte uh, I traveled so far to go to Heroes Con <laughs> But uh, definitely check out those other videos. Uh, we're on the hunt today. See uh, what we can find. Marvel Legends, G.I. Joe Classified Series, Valverse Action Force, and uh, Mythic Legions. I would say uh, I'm excited to uh, see Valverse. Uh, we had a lot of fun with them last year at Joe Fest. And uh, I saw some pictures and stuff. Looks like they have a really cool booth again. So excited to see what they bring to the show. They were definitely teasing some awesome, awesome items being available at the con. So uh, we'll see what, uh, what they have out for Saturday. And uh, our buddies, uh, OG Geek, Mike, uh, Humpty, David, and uh, Big Dub, I believe they all have a booth, so it'd be cool to see what they brought to the show. Uh, hopefully they're having a awesome show and uh, selling a bunch of good stuff, and uh, definitely uh, check out uh, their channels and all the cool things that they have going on. And of course, Greg Cook. We're gonna be meeting up with Greg Cook down at the convention. Uh, that's who we'll be hanging out with. So definitely excited to see Greg. Uh, see if he buys another big vehicle. It's, uh, it's definitely a possibility. Definitely a possibility. So we'll see. Maybe there'll be like a one six scale tank <laughs> in Greg's possession by, uh, by the end of the video. So I'm getting closer to uh, Columbia, 
South Carolina and then we'll kick it over into uh, GA and make our way to Augusta. But uh, come along for the ride. We'll uh, definitely have a lot of fun at the con today. And uh, you never know who we might run into, what we might find. If uh, you're having trouble finding things, uh, check out Big Bad Toy Store. There is a link in the description, Big Bad Toy Store. Uh, get it shipped to your house, get it pre-ordered. Definitely a lot of great stuff uh, available. Again, pre-order, um, in stock. They got so much stuff, uh, Sideshow, Hot Toys, and Boards. Mythic Legions, all kinds of great things online with uh, Big Bad Toy Store. So uh, definitely check them out. Hit that link in the description. And if you just want to help out the channel, all you have to do is uh, just hit that link and take a look. You don't even have to buy anything. So uh, just go check it out. Speaking of helping the channel, we are after that 10K in 2022. So help us out, hit that subscribe button, turn on those notifications so you don't miss a single toy hunt, con, all kinds of good stuff in the channel. Uh, gonna be reworking the display, the collection. So uh, hopefully you get to see some different uh, collection videos. In two miles, stuff. take exit 18 on the right onto Highway 277 miles. South toward I-20 West. Be hitting another uh, spot in our journey, but uh, jump on in. Join Camp Pool Collects here on YouTube and also over on Instagram. All right, let's uh, let's get some of these directions and. Uh, get somewhere let's do something right let's go Get our legs uh, let's grab a little Starbucks to start the morning let's go so I know we are at uh, Joe Fest but in your face we got uh, our vegeta shirt i uh, love my vegeta shirt and it's a saturday must we are at joe fest 2022 it is saturday morning uh, the kind people got us all checked in we're official got our band let's go uh, see i think greg's up to something greg cook is here let's go see what we can find today at the this show or the bird line, let's go. We are headed in. Got a couple Joes, got a Sith Lord, got some weapons, and it is time. What are we going to see at Joe Fest? This is Saturday. Oh, I'm already, I'm already seeing it. I'm seeing the action force. I'm seeing a lot of vehicles, a lot of different things got some Funko Pops over right, there so all kinds of like posters and prints look at this uh, we had so much fun last year we're gonna find our friends and uh, it's gonna be a cool cool show so stay tuned and see what all we find today at uh, Joe Fest Saturday. Tell everybody, are you having a good time at? Uh, I'm having a good time at Joe Fest. Please come to it tomorrow or next year. Enjoy your people. Enjoy yeah. the fun. Enjoy the experience. Thank you. Goodbye. And he, we have a good host hosting the event. And thank you. <laughs> right through the door, got all kinds of Funko Pops. Got some different uh, vehicles and stuff. House of M there. Look at this. Just piles, piles of different toys figures uh one of the reasons we love joe fest uh definitely quite a few different figures the uh spirit you know being joe but uh look at this marvel legends got some gi joe classified series bats alley vipers there three and three quarter inch got some black series so yeah, definitely a lot of opportunities to uh, scoop up some different figures. Hot toys there. 
Got some different graded, got statues. So yeah, we're gonna have a lot of fun checking things out today and uh, seeing what we can find at the show. All right, so it's so awesome. Uh, a year ago, we were checking out figures, seeing different things here at uh, Joe Fest, and now look at uh, all those Action Force figures on the table. Great setup here by uh, Valvers. Got uh, figures across the top. So last year, we saw a lot of the figures just hanging out in the different cases and everything. But look at that. Drew G! Hey, how what's awesome up, Drew? Hey, man. And look at that. Right, Ooh, of course, I Steel Brigades. Uh, popular, popular figure. Look at all the different figures. So we got all the boxes. Got the man himself working back there, making all that Valverse money. Yeah, you too, man. As our troops, we still got to open up a uh, 2B package. So we'll be having that video on the channel very soon. We got Spec Ops, we got the Ryan, got the Urban Trooper. So you have so many options if you're here at the show. All the different figures. Got uh, the different packs. Little Bravo, little Alpha, different packs. And uh, there's some 2B. Series 1, I think they're only sold out. All kinds of great figures. Steel Brigade. Yeah. Running low on Wasp Raiders, but it's Series 2. Wasp Raider pack. Very, very cool. Look at all the figures. No, not for sale. We're just kind of working our way through. Let's go. Yes. You want one of me? Oh, you're actually here. <laughs> I'm here. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, definitely, definitely a cool, cool experience. Okay. So there's some of our 2B, some of our 2A figures. We're just kind of working our way through. Definitely probably going to be a line here most of the day, so we jumped in early and just check out. We're about to unbox these guys. They just came in the other day. How did you remember I needed the Lost Swarm Pack? I've heard you say, I've so cool. read it in the live stream chat <laughs> so many times. <laughs> that is so such a good cool. memory. Yeah, I'm No, because I, I almost messaged you when I left saying, hey, if we run out by the time you get to Joe Fest, I'm, when I get back to Australia, I'll send you one. I've got a spare one. Digital so, payment options. Well, well, I don't, I don't even have the uh, Swarm Trooper yet because he's too big for that I mean, I already have one, but uh, yeah. the second one, you have to come in. Let's see what else we got there. Sergeant Slaughter as well. Got a couple. Got the comics. Uh, packs up. And there's a couple of the prototypes. We'll definitely be uh, taking a look at those. Got our Wasp Raider. Little Night Ops. Very cool. Looking forward to that release. Big Bad Toy Store. But here is your series three, and it uh, is go, all about the ladies. Like yeah, we got these awesome, that. awesome figures. So definitely uh, check out Valverse.com. Get yourself some figures. A lot of retailers, Big Bad Toy Store, a lot of different places carrying those figures. Look at these Joe Fest. Those are pretty cool. Okay. Very cool. Some different head sculpts there. Very nice. Those. I definitely need one of those racks. You selling the racks? <laughs> different custom parts. Got the shield and everything. And we got some loose figures. All kinds of cool stuff. Look at this big old diorama piece. Well, I say big old. It's uh, like. It's a pretty good size. Good old aircraft carrier. Quite a bit of different pieces on there. Very cool. All right, we're gonna keep looking around and uh, see what else we can find. Ooh, little 
little wrestling setup. Got uh, Rick Steiner over there. Very cool. Dio display. Very cool. Check them out. They are definitely on one eighteenth scale and uh, just an awesome, awesome piece. Look at that. Check them out. Dio display. So we found our friends, Animal Warriors of the Kingdom. We saw a lot of their pieces at Koi Lana. These are 112 scale figures. And you can just dump like a hyena here, which is really cool. And, uh, yeah, yeah, man. Of, I, I, even amazing. You know, like the bad, you know, because they got the little strip and, where it sticks uh, to it. Definitely just details anything. Kids, for yeah, to your point, man. Like, yeah, you want your sweat <laughs> Check out uh, <laughs> little artist prints yeah. there. So, definitely some great yeah, articulation gonna, uh, and everything. But uh, definitely some you. great uh, figures. Uh, these yeah. would mix yeah, we're well trying to get our name out. We've only made a business about a year. Me and my wife are both like army vets and uh Definitely oh, some great my figures. Brother, I was going to say and looking my forward to eventually getting some Animal Kingdom in hand. Definitely be a lot of fun. I always tell people that. Out, uh, we got the skeleton, the uh, Robotron. So, I want to do the I want to some different uh, figures and uh, yeah, figure in the there. Uh, and this guy. It's pretty cool. It's like, but check I, out. I really there want it is this. So maybe other person. Obviously, right? you're yeah. seeing it on video. But uh, no, get pretty cool. a lot of different you options, Thank you. Uh, you. Kickstarter and everything. So uh, definitely check them out and get a closer look. A little cockpit uh, vehicle for just about any figures that you can think of. Maybe not uh, our McFarlane, but it'd be a great piece to kind of be a robot, a drone with uh, some of the bigger figures. It definitely is a unique piece and something that would add to your collection. I love uh, the like little launch pad, perfect for our GI Joe figures. Definitely uh, check it out. Got a lot of cool stuff going on. A skeleton, oh, I'm losing him. Like so. Cobra. Awesome cosplay, man. <laughs> Is Greg going to buy all these 501st? We're about to find out. Definitely having a lot of fun at the show. You can see a lot of square footage. Toys, toys, toys. Uh, not quite as many comic books as we saw at the uh, Charlotte Con. But uh, this is a great toy show. Uh, getting to meet a lot of people. So if you came over and said hi, thank you, thank you so much. Uh, definitely enjoy meeting people that are, you know, fans of the channel and uh, supporting the channel. That's uh, what makes it so much fun. So uh, thank you. We're gonna keep looking around and uh, let's go see what else we can find. There's some good stuff out there. Yeah, all these uh, dragon balls. How cool are those? We got some of the old school. There's a trunks. Look at this. Great Saiyan Man. Saga. Majan Boo. Pretty cool. Dragon Ball Pan. Boob. Raccoon, Cyborg, Frieza, Blue. So yeah, definitely some cool Dragon Ball. Got some Spawn figures. Let's go inside the booth and uh, definitely some cool stuff in the booth as well. Got some different uh, Thundercats, Godzilla. Oh, Masters of the okay, Universe. Give me, give me, give me the again. Check this out. How cool is that? It's a nice little pack. The Masters of the Universe. Got some McFarlane going on there. Up top. A lot of different figures. There's uh, some Black Series. Those look nice and cool on the side there. There's uh, the Fat Man. We just found him the other day. All kinds more combat figures. Look at this Might statue. 
Power Rangers there. Let's sneak out. Oh, loose figures. We got some loose figures. All kinds of different stuff. Bebop Rocksteady. Some of the movie stuff. Ooh, there's a dragon man. Ron's gonna be jealous. Little Doctor Doom. Some older toy biz. There's uh, the Captain America. Little toy biz love there. Some older Hasbro and toy biz. Definitely some toy biz there. Check out all oh, the toy biz. Zemo, Steak, there's a little Deadpool, Silk, there's a couple of our new, so there is Wolverine, there's Siren, there is Vulcan, nice. Fantastic Four. Mega Red. Check out uh, everything up top there. Wolverine pack. Old Spider-Man Toy Biz pack. Uh, those are some cool sets. Oh, X-Men there. Daredevil. Daredevil's become very popular. The Netflix Daredevil figure. It's a different movie. Miles Morales, awesome figure. Definitely enjoy that Spider-Verse figure and this Game Reverse one. Definitely some great figures. Iron Man, little MCU, Black Cat, whoa, Inception. Oh my God. Video and video. Cat is a uh, screen. Very cool, definitely uh, digging. We'll have to, ooh, there's that Jubilee little box set. If you haven't scooped up a Jubilee, that might be a good way to get that figure. And what else are we gonna find? Had a channel exclusive. Uh, got the man putting his armor on, getting ready to go back to action. I'm actually, I'm getting this guy a table next year because we, we have spent more time uh, meeting people than looking at toys and chatting and talking. So I'm going to get this guy a recliner next year. <laughs> Everybody, come get your pictures, your videos with Greg Cook in his recliner. And uh, I'll just have the different vendors bring him the stuff. <laughs> he can record and talk about it and help them out. And then they can take it back to their booths. Hey, I don't think this means Ken, nothing will stop us from doing yeah. that. Nothing. Nothing. I uh, I had a bad wheel this week too, so I know I know the feeling. Doing real well. Doing real well. Very cool. Check it out. So great way to add to uh, any of your 12 scale Marvel Legends, GI Joe Classified Series, Valverse Action Force. Uh, definitely a great. We got a weapons pack. A. Got a weapons pack. Again. How cool is that? And uh, even easy to paint and add what you want to them. So yeah, check it out. Mark two toys. Prime One Studios. Check out the GI Joe Snake Eyes. How awesome is that? Cool. Deathstroke. I'm sure Greg's gonna come over and check that out as well. The hats, different things. That's good, yeah. Okay, cool. Some different prints. Ooh, look at those. My own actual cool. I'm sorry. Very cool. Yeah, they're going to be uh, based on the Bible. We have the three archangels. And the oh, archangels. nice. Okay. Yeah, definitely. Awesome. Yeah. Check that out. Very cool. Yeah, we like, uh, we like new figures. Definitely yeah, right. uh, keeping it fresh. But yeah, those are awesome. Definitely so the, the wingspan and everything, that is very cool. Yeah, fully articulated wings, they'll actually take a fold down like an armor. Oh, and nice, okay. Seraphim, so they have a lower wing, which could plug into a four inch figure. Very cool. Yeah. 
Right. Awesome. Definitely uh, check it out. We got all the info. Uh, check out the description if you want to go check them out. But uh, this is cool. Thank you so much. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you. Where are we watching? Skating away. Pulling with these amps, that rotate. It's got the old fashioned legacy wheels like the old legacy right. goes, and then your box, home packs, and turns into your die around. Oh, that's cool. So you get everything that you need for your place at all in one shot. That is cool. We have a limited run of the green ones in stock today for the okay. show, and then we're doing pre orders for the gray and the tan, all army builder sets. We're going to be doing those as well. And those will come with new diorama sets. Yes, sir. That's cool. That's very, very cool. <laughs> Joe Fest, we got a few uh, Mythic Legions here. Very cool. Some different uh, Masters of the Universe. We got that guy. Got this guy. Got that guy. But uh, yeah, definitely cool to see some Mythic Legions. We got uh, the Force. And seeing some different Marvel Legends and stuff, so not a bad little move. Let's just see if we can sneak around. We were uh, spoiled yesterday. Yesterday, we could just like walk around all over the con, but there are definitely a few people here today. Got some loose figures, little Jack Joes, little Sarge, Goliath, some Silhouette. Some two packs, Hellfire Club. Look at all those. There's some NECA Ninja Turtles. All kinds. Black Series. Droids. McFarlane. There's some more Marvel Legends. Got some retro cards. There's a uh, Wolverine up there taking a nap. Ghostbusters, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. All right, let's see what we got. Marvel Legend wise, definitely got a few Marvel Legends. A few Marvel Legends. So we're gonna keep looking around and uh, see what else we can find. We found our friends Bits and Buttons here at uh, the show. We uh, last saw them at ICCC. And uh, you've seen them on a ton of different YouTube videos, uh, Seth and MCE. So they always got some great stuff and uh, always happy to see them at uh, some of these different shows this year. They actually have their own YouTube channel now. So definitely check out Bits and Buttons on YouTube, uh, doing some cool stuff. I'm sure they'll have a Joe Fest video. And look, we got the Dragon Man himself, Humpty. He is taking care of business. Look at all these dragons. That is so cool. Hot Toys, got a little Spider-Man, Spider-Man, Batman. Got some different Star Wars there. That skull mountain. That was pretty cool. We go this way. Check out the turtles. Oh, the different turtles. Got some Sarge and Slaughter. Different turtles. Look at that Hulk. <laughs> that Hulk is amazing. All kinds of G.I. Joe Cobra. Oh man, that Air Commando, that is so cool. But uh, they got the brick and mortar. They are at some different shows. So there's the man himself. You can uh, you can watch him, but uh, tell him about the YouTube channel, man. The YouTube channel's out. That's right, Bits and Buttons. Check us out on YouTube. It's still growing, it's still growing. We're working on the kinks and trying to really get into the rhythm and making the channel. I'm not an expert yet, but I just film the content and have uh, I have my secret editor take care of all the rest. But. Very cool, very cool. Uh, I definitely enjoyed uh, going like the behind the scenes stuff. Yeah, man, it's different. There's gonna be a Joe Fest video, right? There is. The Joe Fest video will probably be our better videos just because again, just working the kinks out all different things. Um, we do have a lot of content that's gonna be coming out. We have a lot of different things planned for the channel. We're just not really talking about it because we don't want to give everybody too much information. And again, it's not about competition. It's just about we have local stores and things yep. like that that we don't want to 
open up Pandora's box, so to speak. We don't want to give them any ideas to make their own uh, content. So stay tuned for the channel. As the channel continues to grow, we're going to be pushing out different types of uh, videos each week. Uh, but the the uh, conventions are really good. And then, like I said, when we do these uh, toy, not really a toy hunt, but when we do these toy buys, it's going to be interesting. Yeah, so it's, uh, it's been a lot of fun to watch. So definitely subscribed. And uh, if you guys haven't found Bits and Buttons on YouTube yet, uh, go check them out. Uh, I love the Instagram too, uh, seeing all the Instagram posts. Oh, for sure, man. Got to stay active. I appreciate the, everybody looks at me sometimes is like, oh man, he's kind of goofy or he's kind of like standoffish, but hey man, <laughs> It's business is business. Uh, I enjoy. I'm very humbled for the opportunity that everybody provides me, and, and just all around the world, and just you know what I'm able to bring to everybody. Just I'm very appreciative because again, yeah, we have a lot of followers on Instagram, and this store is like toy department. They've been around just as long, and it's just our social media is just very strong because we're very active with it, and everybody yep. that follows us and supports us, I am very appreciative of it. So. Believe me, thank you. Thank you and your subscribers and everybody else out there. Appreciate you guys. Awesome, appreciate it. The original Dragon Man. How's it going? Who's uh, 1500 to steal? Did uh, dragons, dragons included? I was priced out. Very cool. So uh, Humpty definitely uh, doing the dragons here at the show. What's, uh, what's the next show the dragons are going to be at? Uh, it's probably going to be Florida Supercon. All right, so if you, uh, you need these dragons, these things are awesome. Uh, people had so much fun at Toy Atlanta and G.I. Joe show. But I see dragons. Dragons are taking over the G.I. Joe show. <laughs> they are. They are. Where's the cool one? <laughs> All right, we are going around the Marvel Legends. All kinds of good stuff. Look at those clones. Little Yoda. We got uh, a little bit of Mythic Legions. We'll come back for those. Some Joes. There he is. So I, I can't title my video. I witnessed 100 hot toys being sold. <laughs> this guy can sell some hot toys. If you haven't uh, already subscribed, OG Geek, I know you're subscribed. If for some reason you didn't subscribe, get over and watch this guy. Uh, that hot, hot toys video just blew my mind, man. Y'all are, uh, are just doing a lot of cool stuff, so definitely don't want to miss out. And I don't know, are you, uh, you're a vlog now, right? Pretty much make toy related vlogs. Because, you know, I gave up on toy hunting. I am a toy inventorier now. So I go around Walmart. They know what they have in their store because I've gone through and like pointed everything out. I, I don't know that I can be a toy hunter anymore. But check it out. They got some great stuff. Uh, Star Wars, if you're ever looking for Star Wars stuff. And they're doing all these shows and everything. So definitely uh find them at the show say hello subscribe og geek street geeks doing so much good stuff and uh, a lot of great figures look at that jeep and everything got the sentinel they like gave a sentinel away so that is so awesome got some build figures back there you can see a lot of good stuff so definitely a lot of people got the uh, mandalorian up there we'll show you in a little bit uh you know i'm excited to see some mythic legions all right so check it out we got uh some great mythic legions look at this guy that is a very very cool mythic legion there got uh our dwarf our black knight we might have to talk to david about a black knight there's our builder all the different parts and everything our uh, noble bear got some skeletons got our templar definitely a lot of good pieces there we got got at least oops, all good my bad got we'll get a shot of david so there's david david's not gonna say hello so Joe Fest, uh, let's get a few Joes. Got our three and three quarter inch. How about some classified Joes? All kinds of figures. Got uh, Farland. 
There's some more Marvel Legends. Look at all those Marvel Legends. Star Wars. And some Nick Farland. Very cool. So many different toys. So many different toys. Check out all the Predators. Very cool. Thank you. <laughs> Check out. That is so cool. Some predators for you. Got some smaller predators. Some Star Wars mix in with Giacho. Check out all the minifigs. Got the Terror Dome. Got a little Spider Hulk. That is awesome. Definitely a lot of cool stuff. All right, got some older G.I. Joe. Check out the vehicles. Three and three quarter inch, all about the vehicles. Got uh, some gunneries there. Look at that boat, that is so cool. All the different figures. Got a couple jets up top flying away. A couple helicopters as well. A little spaceship, a little dinosaur there, Jurassic Park. Got some larger G.I. Joe's. That one's pretty cool. Firefly. Nice. Baroness. Oh, My Little Pony sneaking in there. A couple Marvel Legends. But yeah, look at all the different vehicles. Got the little base there as well. Definitely a lot of cool stuff. Look at that. Cobra the Enemy. Cobra Trooper. Let's see. Transformers, that's pretty cool. A little heavyweight title, a couple gremlins. Daredevil, that's pretty cool. Little He-Man going on. Ah, we've been seeing uh, Razor Crest hitting different uh, shows. Got a bunch of loose Transformers, that's kind of cool. And then some of the different builders there on the bottom. Got a couple jets going on. Get all the transformers though. We're trying to keep out of everyone's way. That is so cool. All kinds of transformers. Got a few pops. There's a couple uh, smaller vehicles. Little trooper added. Got a couple of loose things here. A couple cannons. Loose figures, got some carded, so and it is like last year I felt like there was so much G.I. Joe stuff, it is so crazy like how diverse the show is this year, which is awesome because why put yourself into just one category when you have the ability to showcase all this cool stuff? Storm Shadow. Valor versus Venom. That's a cool little pack there. Transformers. There's some classified little bats. Some um, carded figures. A little Ahsoka going on there. Some Mandalorian. More Transformers. Did not expect to see uh, all these Transformers here. So that is pretty cool. Little uh, SDCC. Look at that. There's parts. All kinds of parts. The snake eyes. Check out who we found. I uh, definitely enjoy everything I see in the cabal. But look at this. Little action force. Yeah. Yeah. Joe classified series. How cool is that? Yeah, it wasn't just the uh, extra features that you kind of build on with the soft goods is uh, just so cool. And they do such a good job with these designs. <laughs> I'm telling him to get mythic <laughs> legions. Yeah. Is that is that a hazard squad complete? Yes, yes, complete. Well, you can always tell you're an idiot. So good. <laughs> I still do you can definitely uh, follow uh, if you're looking for soft goods. Again, G.I. Joe Classified Series, Marvel Legends, all kinds of good stuff. Alright, so check out. We got Cable. Look at that. Uh, all Might. That is so good. Carnage. Got a little Piccolo. Bardock. 
go go tanks, boo. So uh, definitely some cool little Dragon Ball there. Switch it up a little bit. And then you got uh, the Mezco there as well and guts. So very cool. Check out uh, these How's armored. Going, Enjoying the show? Oh yeah, having so much fun. These are great. Nice little armored vehicles. Look at the troopers on patrol and uh, just put different colors and everything. It's so cool. You can definitely do some different things and uh, get your troops moving if you're a army builder. Of course you want a vehicle. Look at this Cobra cool. That is so cool. Definitely uh, check them out. There is the information. Go on and uh, get yourself a little troop builder, troop carrier. Jerry the King Noir, got Ricky Dragon Steamboat, little Stoners, very cool. Star Wars fans, we got that brand new Darth Vader from Obi-Wan. How cool is that? Some more hot toys. So, uh, always the worst part of the con, we are about to say bye to uh, Greg Cook. Um, you're crazy if you haven't been following this guy. Get over to Greg Cook Photography every social media platform especially here on youtube uh give this guy a subscribe a like a comment uh just because you subscribe we want to hear from you we yeah. want uh we want channel subscribers involved reacting all that fun stuff don't uh, don't be that quiet person don't be that uh every once in a while come uh come comment let us know uh what you're seeing in the video, what we're missing. I, I can't tell you how much uh, we go through and like, hey, you saw that thing that you passed? What thing? What? That was, was somebody, in my video? There was somebody commented, like, evidently I walked past a, an Angus uh, little figure chase. I'm like, I didn't even know that little thing. I was chasing <laughs> that figure. I learned something from the comments. That's right. So uh, we, we definitely enjoy uh, meeting people. We got to meet so many people at the con today. Uh, definitely when I get back, we're going to take a look at what we picked up. So I'm gonna hook you, I'm gonna keep you a little bit longer, but we're, uh, we're gonna say bye to Greg and uh, tons of awesome people here at the show. So many to list, to name. Uh, some of our uh, YouTube friends, I'll have links in the description. Uh, again, I don't wanna miss anybody, but Mike, OG Geek, uh, David, Big Dub, Humpty. of course, Humpty, so a Victoria. lot of uh, Victoria, a lot of uh, awesome, awesome people here at the show, yes. and uh, just uh, too many to name to list, but appreciate people coming, hanging out with us, and taking that show to the next level. Let's uh, get back to the toy room and see what we got. Welcome back. We are hanging out uh, in the garage and we got us a pretty good haul from Joe Fest 2022. I uh, did a little bit of trading with my buddy, Big Dub, Brian. Go, uh, go check him out if you haven't already subscribed to his channel. He is uh, getting very close to 5K. He's got a big, huge max uh giveaway that he's got going on so uh go check out big dub on uh youtube i'll have a link in the description but uh we traded some mythic legions at the show and i got to meet an awesome awesome family in the cabal in the mythic legions community a little uh strump family crafts we got some soft goods this is a very very awesome cape had uh so much fun chatting with them and uh finding out what they do and uh just uh you know everybody i meet <laughs> with the cabal and everything it is uh just so much fun enjoy chatting talking figures talking legions it is uh just way too much fun and uh they do some awesome awesome soft goods to uh kind of build and add to your characters so we're gonna open these up there is so much with that barbarian uh builder this is gonna be so cool and this guy 
rare, 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 we got the Pixis. Pixis! Ah, Pixel Dan. Tribute skeleton in the collection. So cool. But uh, let's quit talking. Let's open them up and uh, see what you get. All right. <laughs> this is craziness. Barbarian builder. Ah, you got like the different belts. Look at this. Choose like the horns, make his helmet. Two different helmets. Pauldrons. Like it's just crazy the uh just combinations and kind of put your own figure together and as if that wasn't cool enough you got uh, all the weapons it's like uh venti tall <laughs> choose your sword got more additions so uh, you can add those to uh, the helmets and uh, the axe the spear just a lot of options for your figure. A true builder you can kind of play around with the design and uh, decide what you want. Uh, the barbarian with the beard that is so cool. I'm gonna show you um, the other helmet there. That's pretty cool. We've seen that with uh, some of our other legions. Check out this cape got uh some wires in there and everything so yeah this is gonna be fun just kind of rest over the figure but uh gonna be great add a nice layer addition to any of the figures so we'll play around with that in just a minute but here is the guy building out our skeleton crew pixis at the armor got the helmet that is so cool that's probably how i'll probably have him wearing the helmet but uh, the skull's not a bad look either got uh, some extenders wings all that good stuff nice sword got his belt golden shield so yeah i am pumped Definitely excited to uh, have another awesome, awesome skeleton. I can cross one more off of the list. Thank you so much, uh, Brian. Big dubs. Go uh, check him out. And uh, we're going to play around with this builder. Play around with our cape. And uh, get Pixis all set up. Let's do it. All right, so here's our first combination of the Barbarian Builder. I went with, like, the eagle bird wings rocking the beard, which is pretty cool. And uh, got the axe, the long sword just kind of sitting there on the side because, hey, he's a, he's a big fella. He can, uh, he can carry it there to the side. Uh, Pixis... Got uh, the long sword, rocking the spear. Got that uh, gladiator kind of helmet. Um, gladiator, you know, the 300 <laughs> look, if you would. He is uh, definitely a warrior back. Is he uh, back for vengeance? And uh, just digging the colors. Definitely like the blue and everything going on with the character the spear the sword <clears throat> definitely uh having fun with that figure and then uh brought in our <laughs> old man owen uh using that custom head sculpt so he's got uh, the beard and everything he might need a hat but uh, i could imagine him on a campaign Maybe it's a little colder, they're in the mountains, it's snowing, and uh, got the cape on, trying to stay warm, uh, maybe just tossing off the cape and ready for battle. Let me know what you think uh, in the comments. Uh, again, Joe Fest, I was uh, not, 
Well, I was kind of expecting to come back with, uh, with a couple of figures because, like I said, knew I was going to be trading. But uh, the cape was a nice addition and was definitely surprised to see the different variety of figures that was at Joe Fest. Uh, Valorverse was cool to see all the figures there and uh, just the presence that they had to, at the show was pretty cool. We saw some different stores that we've been to, uh, Toy Federation, Needless Toys, Blake's. So it was uh, definitely some cool vendors, our buddies, David, Mike, OG Geek. Uh, getting to see bits and buttons, Humpty. It just, uh, it was just so much fun. Definitely had a lot of fun at the con. Of course, uh, Brian and uh, the girls. It was uh, definitely a lot of fun seeing them as well. But who knew? <clears throat> who knew? We'd be walking away. Live more Mythic Legions. But let me know in the comments, uh, did you enjoy the con footage? What did you think of Joe Fest 2022? Let me know if you're at the show and uh, definitely say hello. Even if uh, you came by and talked to me and Greg, uh, definitely say hello in the comments. That's very cool and uh, definitely would be happy to uh, make sure I know everybody off and online it can be a little bit of challenging with some of the different screen names and everything but uh it was uh so much fun i bet you we spent uh half of the con just uh talking with people which was uh very very awesome and uh, a lot of fun you made it this far in the video you know what to do subscribe hit that button join jump into kent pool collects we're having a lot of fun here on YouTube. Also over on Instagram, at Kent Pool Collects. Uh, yeah, just a fun, fun show. Definitely came away with some really cool items. And, uh, you know, just help us out. Like, comment, and share. We're working on that 10K in 2022. So definitely subscribing will uh, help us out, help us reach that goal. If you wanna help out the channel, there is a link in the description, Big Bad Toy Store. Uh, if you see things in the video, good chance they might be at uh, Big Bad Toy Store. So go ahead and click that link. If you just click on the link, it helps out the channel. And uh, you can look around and see what they have at Big Bad Toy Store. It's uh, definitely appreciated, and again, just kind of supports the channel. You don't even have to buy anything. Just uh, click on the link and take a look. Thank you, thank you to all of our subscribers. Y'all are too kind, helping out, supporting the channel. Definitely appreciate it. To our awesome channel members, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. And until next time, always be hunting, have fun collecting. I'm not afraid of